Hi there, welcome to Noswear channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how to export data in the data grid view and MySQL database into Excel format using Visual Basic.net. First, let's open our Visual Studio and create new project. Choose Windows Home application and I put my project into desktop and I will give the name my project is export to excel okay you can download uh, this project and source code in the description I put link into the description so you can just click there I click create and in here we need two buttons okay I will add button in here and I will copy And we need also data grid view. Okay. The first button is for showing uh, our text in here or our data. Show data. And the second button is for exporting to Excel. First, we need to create more larger in here. I think it's enough. Then, before we create our making coding in here, we need to create a database in here. Just using PHP my admin, and I will create a database for DB export in here. I will not uh, input manually, so I will import my table. You can uh, fill manually, but for faster to create the tutorial, I decide to prepare the table. So we need or we have data like this in here, and later uh, we will try to export into Excel. And then uh, we need to create access data in here, access data folder to save our uh, class for connection to database. I will give the name is DT connection. Then, like uh, I said before. To save our time for creating tutorials, I prepare my codes in here and you can download a link into the description and you can improve. This is my connection. Okay, in here we need to add reference my SQL dot data and you can see in the previous tutorial in our channel. How to add reference for my SQL? We need to create or click project and add reference. Just assembly and extension and find my SQL data in here and click OK. Now your my SQL will declare or no error in here. This is our server is local host user using root and database refer to our database db export in here. Now we need to back to our form one and click in the show data. First in here I prepare my code and you can improve later with your code. I'm sorry. Let's just uh okay I will type in here import my SQL dot data dot my SQL client and we will showing button 
or showing data with button 1 in here. This is not declared because we don't have yet copy this radian declaration. You can put below uh, public class form. And then we need to click double click in export to Excel in here. And we can copy this code. Okay, you can download uh, this project via link in the description. After that, the last is copying our uh, release object. Okay, I paste in here. Now, uh, in the Microsoft Office Interop Excel application, we need to add reference because we need to third party in here. We can right click in the our project and click reference. And let's choose manually Microsoft.office. Microsoft.office. We need to find carefully Microsoft the obvious that is Microsoft Office Excel 12.0 object library you can click OK in here this is Microsoft Office Core Reference. Refer to our Excel 12.0 library. If you click this, you can see Microsoft Office 12.0 object library. Now, uh, we need to select this table, table book. You can Change in the MySQL command in here from TB book not like this and let's start our project. I will show data. You can see there there is my uh, data in the data grid view. If you want to make this to docking, it's better. Like this. And I will showing data in here. And you can see there. Okay, I will export into Excel. Let's try. Now, this is my book. I click save in here. Now, you can improve our code with your code. Let's see our Excel in here. Contain 15 data in here, and let's see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Yes, uh, I mean it's 14 because this is a title, guys, and you can see there. This is for our title. This is. And our data has been uh, exported to Excel successfully. You can improve our code with your code. And 
I said again, you can download this code and the project into description that I put link into there. Thanks for watching. Hope this helpfully. Bye bye.